Okay, let's talk about playing live gigs. How does the business model technically look like and what you should, what do you need to know technically? So this is the business model PDF. If you want it, ask me on Discord, I will send it to you and then you can fill it in for yourself. So if you play live music, technically your customers will come from people that walks around. They will come to you and then they give you money or they give you small change and that's technically it. So technically your customer can be anyone. Yeah. So customer segment can be anyone. Yeah. But it depends also where you are. Let's say you play live gig at a train station. People that walk in the train station, they give you small change. Let's say you play some live gigs online. People that know your channel, your community, they will give you small change like a donation. That's technically it. So technically the people, it can be location or it can be online and from your community. They give you small change. What's the value that you pro um, give them? It's technically entertainment. Yeah, value proposition, entertainment, it can be your music, can be anything, whatever you do. Yeah, you create music, you give them entertainment, they pay you for it. That's technically it. And if you are asking yourself what makes myself unique, you. That's simple. You, your own stuff. That's technically it. Yeah, you don't have to be like everyone else. You, your own stuff. Yeah, if people like it, people like it. That's simple. Yeah. So, if you want to promote this, it depends. If you're online, you can tell people, hey, I'm going to um, play live at that um, train station or whatever. You can tell them through social media. Yeah. If you want to keep contact or communication with your customer, then you look at the customer relationship. That's technically it. What you really need, I cannot tell you what you really need. That's up to you. Yeah. But you need something to create music and you need something to, um, yeah, to do in order to entertain people. That's technically it. So this part is up to you. Yeah. If you're going to work together with other people, it's up to you. I cannot tell you what you need to do. Yeah. The cost, keep it as low as possible. So the cost, what do you need to buy? If you go to a train station, you need to buy a um, ticket or food or whatever. You can use the money that you get from the people in order to pay for the cost. So technically, the money that the people will pay you will go to the revenue. That's technically how you see it. That's technically this business model. It's not that difficult, but it's technically it. Yeah. Keep in mind, it is simple, but keep in mind, make sure you make for every structure, for every situation, business model, so you know this works and this doesn't work. Because if you do this, you will know. If you do this, you will know, okay, this business model has a high profit margin. Okay, I'm going to keep doing that. That's technically how you need to see it. That's why it's important to put the cost and the revenue. And based on this, you will know if it's going to work for you or not. And also your time. Keep that in mind. So, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. Subscribe already. If you like this video, like it. If you have questions about it or if you have some ideas in order to make it much better, feel free to go on Discord, create a support ticket, and ask me, ask me questions about it. I hope you guys like this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.